Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. Today we're in another community. Um, haven't sold a home in this community yet, so this will be the first one. Um, and what a little jewel of a community. This is Rancho Riata. Um, it's in East Mesa, real easy access to the uh, 60 and, and 202, just kind of off of Crisman in between Southern and Broadway. But you can see how nice and clean this community is. Space rent is super reasonable. Um, I'll have to find out exactly how many home sites are here, but it's a fairly small community, individually owned, and this is a 1984 Cameron. Um, it's a 14 by 79, which is uh, super long for your typical single wide, uh, and it is a three bedroom. So we're gonna go in. Um, she's got a bunch of cute decor in there. Um, she is gonna be taking most of her furniture, but some of it's negotiable. Um, I will show you down that carport side here in a little bit. Uh, because there's a, a deck on that side as well, so we've got a nice deck. Um, it's well, about two o'clock in the afternoon right now, and it does face west, so you're gonna have a nice sun on your rear patio in the morning, so you can kind of see it's a really nice big lot. Little tip of the Superstition Mountains there. Good space between the homes as well. You're not right on top of each other. Um, she wasn't sure exactly how, how old the uh, air was, but um, she's had it serviced and looked at, and I guess it's in really good condition. Uh, there's also a shed there we'll look at here in a minute, but I want to take you inside. Super cute place. Has a lot of updates. It has a uh, new, newer within the last few years uh, PVC plumbing, uh, newer appliances. So we're gonna go inside and meet Kathy and Ace. Uh-oh, she said there was a problem with this screen door. <laughs> I guess when they, when they uh, moved her furniture and they had to take the screen door off, so it doesn't work very well. Um, but anyway, there's Ace. And Ace and I have been playing ball this morning. Ace is very, very playful. Hi, Ace. Yes, you're going to be on YouTube. You're going to be the YouTube dog. But anyway, we walk in. Nice open kitchen. It does have the vault uh, throughout the kitchen, dining room, and living room area. And this is Kathy. Kathy uh, has really gone in depth with me today about some of the improvements that um, have been made to the property and um, those include some newer plumbing. Um, and tell me about your appliances. These are almost well within the last, last year. year. Yeah. So it's got the double door frost roof fridge and the only thing that is gas in this home is the gas range which is awesome. Gas is so good to cook with. Um, dishwasher isn't quite working right. She uh, says it is fairly newer, but um, doesn't know what's wrong with it, doesn't use it. So there's no warranty on the uh, dishwasher as far as being in working condition. Um, she's going to be taking her microwave. There's a few personal items that she's going to be taking in some of the furniture and uh, some of the things that are negotiable potentially. Um, are that china hutch there. She's willing to leave the dining room set with the padded chairs and the drop leaf and then the nice island um, in the kitchen. Um, she's willing to leave the the wicker chairs, that one side table there, the floor lamp. Um, she's going to be taking her TV in the TV stand most likely and you're taking your fireplace of course. Yes, yes that's a nice one. Um, so we'll go ahead and go into the master bedroom to start off with. Yeah, it's a nice size master. It's currently got a queen bed. Nice squishy carpet throughout too. It's got a really nice carpet and pad. Um, but you can see it's got plenty of room in here. It's got the big sliding wardrobe there. The master bath has the garden tub with the shower. And nice vanity there. Uh, she's going to be taking that cute little toiletry cabinet and then Ace you gonna go look at the rest of the house with us nice pantry um, the cabinets were modified a little bit so it's actually got shelves where they should be see everything is just super clean and then we walk back and this is the second bedroom 
um, which she currently uses as a, as a guest room. She's planning on taking her bed, but that um, headstand is actually a leather headstand, and it will fit a queen bed, and that will go ahead and stay if somebody wants it. Um, and then this uh, table lamp, this floor lamp with the magazine shelf and glass insert will stay. Uh, nice shelving in here. For people that want a guest room and have a separate office, um, this would be a perfect office area. And then we turn the corner and it has the full tub shower combination here with the, again, the extended vanity. Uh, she's willing to leave that secured to the wall. It's really cute. And then tub shower combination right here. High rise stool full-size washer and dryer, and a Whirlpool and Kenmore. Uh, this is the third bedroom, which she's currently using as like a sewing um, office, library, really good size. Uh, it's got the blackout shades, little built-in chest there, nice big wardrobe. She's willing to leave this too, which is really cool. She showed me it actually opens up into a desk, which is super awesome. I love that piece. I would love to have that piece. And now we will go outside. There's the, uh, the furnace. Like I said, the water heater and the furnace are both electric. And we come out here and we've got a nice additional um, deck here with the uh, metal railing and then I'll ask her if she's gonna leave the barbecue I'm not sure and then the sheds up oh, the sheds locked so we got to get the key of the shed but um, two car parking in line do you want to give me the shed key all right, right thank you, thank you. The workbench and the shelf stay. What about the barbecue? Are you going to take the barbecue? No, it could stay. It could stay. Okay. It's been used twice. Ah, that looks like a nice one. It is. It's a big one. Yep. Wow, look at this workshop. Woohoo! This is awesome, you guys. <laughs> Love it. I don't know what tool she's uh, taking or willing to leave, but. This is, this is such a good size. Wow. This is super awesome. This is big. I'm gonna step this off. I'm not sure how big this is, but it is big. And it's matching and connected with the house, which is really cool. And it uh, looks like she's got the uh, sensor lights there. So I'm just gonna step this off. Three, six, nine, twelve, fifteen, like sixteen long. Three, six, nine, twelve, probably twelve wide. So, really good size. You can see what some of the people have done in their back patio areas here, which is really nice. You've got room for uh, blocked in rear sun patio, which would be super nice out here, especially in the morning, because you're going to get the morning sun on your back side of your house. And this is that split floor plan that is so popular because you've got the, you know, master on one side and your guest room on the other, so it gives some nice privacy if you have guests. Ace! <laughs> one good thing about this community, too, is if you have a larger pet, they do allow uh, larger non-dangerous breeds in this community, which is really nice because it's hard to find communities where... The space rent's reasonable, and they allow larger animals. So um, that shed is something else. Is that nice? Yes, it is really nice. So is there anything else that you can think of that you would want people to know maybe about the community? Just very quiet, very well patrolled. Um, that's, that's about all. How I many think. sites are in here? 121, I think. Okay, yeah, so it's, a, it's you know, it's decent. It's not big. Site. Yeah. And you were saying in the winter months they have a lot of activities and stuff for people? All the time. And what All are some of those? 
They have dances, they have karaoke night, they have potlucks. Um, trying to think. They have entertainers that come in, they have game nights, they have cards all the time. Mm -hmm. And you said they have a nice pool? Yes, very nice pool. I'll have to go up there and like, And they do just this redid video. all the chairs and stuff out there, so it's really nice. So they keep the community up pretty well? Yes, very yeah. much so. Yeah, that's important. And um, what are you close by here, like grocery store wise? And um, Walmart is like two miles away. Okay. Safeway is two and a half. Bashes is about two. Okay. Home Depot is not even quite a mile. Um, Walgreens is at the corner. Uh, there's a uh, bank next door to them. Uh, the hospital is two blocks away. Yeah, it's a really great location for and sure. And it's quiet. It, it, it really is. You don't hear sirens. You don't hear police. It, it just seems to be very quiet. What have you heard about break-ins in this community? They had a little bit, supposedly, at the very first when the snowbirds left. Mm -hmm. And that's all I know. Yeah, it's pretty. I mean, there it's happening in all the communities. So, I mean, it's, you, you're not going to be safe from it really anywhere. No, and the manager drives it. Two and three and four times. I know. Right when I pulled up, he was pulling up to see who I was. He I was drives very... <laughs> it about 8.30 every night. Yeah, I was really impressed with that. <laughs> He's very conscious of people that don't belong here. Yeah, that was really good. I was really impressed with that. Yeah. And um, do you want to share um, why you're selling? Just my health is not... The house is too big. My health is not the best. My mom and dad's health are failing. So I want something a little smaller for me. Yeah. And other than that, it's a nice place. I love the trailer. It's beautiful. But it's just bigger than I want for just me. Yeah. Less, you need less to take care of. Yes. <laughs> yeah. The All right. It's just not there. So. Okay. Well, um, really uh, say prayers on both of our hills. You know, we, uh, yeah. every day is a miracle that we get to be here for That's sure. True. And, uh, Find a place for Ace so Ace can have a place, too, where Ace can run and grab the ball. <laughs> he sure loves you. He's my buddy. <laughs> All right. Well, um, what a great buy on this place. Um, the list price is fourteen nine. Uh, kind of went over some of the furniture that was uh, negotiable in that. Uh, she needs about 30 days, um, you know, heads up if somebody wants to buy this. And just a really cute place. So... Kathy, thank you so much for this. If uh, somebody's interested in this property, um, you can visit us on our website at www.azactiveresorts.com or our YouTube channel, which is azactiveresortsdot.com. Uh, the web reference number on this property is going to be RR, like rough, 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 <laughs> 212 ME. And, uh, Feel free to give me a call, 1-800-478-3864. And I'm Kara. What a cute place and a great buy for somebody. All right, folks, we will talk to you soon, and have a great day.